Pamela, for more than 30 years, police, police have not been able to identify the body of a woman found in Heflin, but some advancements in forensics may finally give them some answers. Now, this is a body of a woman that was found in the wooded area in February of 1990. It was found uh, by a logging company, and police believe that the body had been there for a year or two. They submitted some dental records, but that still didn't turn up any answers. Recently, though, Heflin police sent the body to LSU and their forensics lab, and they just sent them back a reconstructed image to Heflin police this week. Now, Captain Scott Bonner is hoping that someone will recognize the image. I would really, if, if, if someone sees that and they think that that might be a loved one from that time, um, the retainer's big, the earrings are big, um, if they will get with us, I would like to have enough people to do once the DNA does come back. Now, here's another look at that reconstruction. You can see this is what they know right now. She's a white female between the ages of 22 and 34. She had shoulder length brown hair and she was between five feet and five four. Now, you get again, you heard Captain Bonner mentioned the earrings. She had a retainer in her mouth as well. This could be two big keys. She was found in 1990, but they believe that she had been missing as early as 1988. So if you recognize this image, if you have any information, call police. They are working hard to solve this and learning her identity is key.